Welcome to All Play Games Weekly, where we bring you a weekly dose of tech news, games, and inspiration. I'm Brian Karsten. I'm William DeBacary. Batten down the hatches and tighten your wagon wheels, pioneers. Let's get into it. This week's updates are all about how you control your favorite games. Whether on PC, console, or mobile, we want to get you the best and brightest devices in your hands. Let's start with the global powerhouse, PC Gaming. If you play PC, then you know the name Logitech. Killing the game since 1981 and imported from Switzerland, Logitech holds down the top spot for PC handheld controllers with their GamePad F310 on most online top 10 lists that we could find. From ease of compatibility to its extremely basic user-friendly button mapping, this thing meets all users with a familiar landscape. Hold the phone though, because Windows 10 is now compatible with the PlayStation DualShock controller, and this is going to give Logitech a headache. I'm sure they're going to be just fine with their virtual monopoly on the PC gaming mice market though. I do have to say Logitech's MX518, G903, or G502 Hero might hold the throne for now, but look out for Razer who is making a run at them with the Death Adder Elite. If you're the guy or gal who never wants to conform to the market, I suggest looking into this mouse for your FPS and RTS gaming needs. Will, what do you prefer? Handheld controller or mice and pad for PC gaming? Oh, I knew you were going to go here with this. Um... I am a console kid, so I was growing up on console. I've been a console kid ever since I can remember, so I like that controller in my hand. I like having that peripheral I always have. Now, I will tell you is that I am a little bit better when it comes to mouse and keyboard if I get, if I dedicate the time to do it. If I dedicate the time to do it, I'm a much better PC player. So gotcha. that's what I'll say. Now on to console. This is where things get a bit hairy. Since every console has their own proprietary controller, it's hard to pin down which is best. If you play Xbox and you've used an Xbox controller your whole life, well, I bet you'll choose an Xbox controller. I've spent more time on PlayStation devices, so as you guessed it, I love the feel of the DualShock controller in my hands. So to settle the score, we once again scoured the interwebs to find surprisingly that the Xbox One controller had the most number one ratings out there. The King of Controller has a new Xbox Elite Wireless Series 2 controller coming out that was just announced at E3 this year. With new adjustable tension thumbsticks, redesigned trigger grips, wraparound rubberized grips, and 40 hours of gameplay off just one charge, I don't see how this beast doesn't meet the competition and run away with it in the future. This is obviously a huge opinion-based subject, so please leave a comment on this video with your choice. Finally, on to mobile. This was a slam dunk, as SteelSeries Stratus XL dominated the Bluetooth Android compatible market. This controller is, on, is the only one I found to also pop up on a few best controllers all time lists. With a very similar layout and feel to the Xbox One controller, I can see why this device has garnered so much praise by the gaming community. And last but not least, the future of gaming. If you've been paying attention to All Play Games Weekly, then you already know. But Google Stadia might take over the globe with their new controller that connects directly to Google's custom gaming data centers. For more on this device, check out our previous videos. All right, Will, what do you have in store for our pioneers? All right, so the Nintendo um, O-ring revealed <laughs> itself last week, and y'all better keep your inappropriate thoughts to yourself, because Nintendo's new peripheral is not called the O-ring. It's advertised as a physical fitness tool designed to have others watch you when you work out. Uh, anyway, this new teaser ad from Nintendo shows many people across various parts of the world, you guessed it, working out together. Hmm, maybe you're competing against these people? I don't know. In any case, Nintendo says we will find out more on September 12th. Now back for more ranking up FPS gaming tips, here's Piercing Guest for all you out there stuck in ELO hell. This is kind of some advanced tactics that you can get used to doing, but essentially what you want to do is you zoom in and hit some close sight lines within yours, and then you reacquire target while you're in hip fire mode. Thanks, Pierce, for all those great rank up tips that I know work. Check out our Gamer's Mindset series where Pierce helps me rank up my silver Overwatch anime gameplay. Now for our quote of the week from famed artist Andrew Hendrickson, Anyone who has ever made anything of importance was disciplined. Conceive your idea, plan your action, attack those goals, pioneers. Thanks for tuning in to All Play Games Weekly. Take care, be well, and we'll see you next week. Later, guys.